Philip Johnson, who, by the way, just died about a week ago, just had his funeral at UCAL Berserkly on Saturday. Brilliant guy. He's died at 79 years old. Wrote a number of books. Darwin on Trial was the first one. Anyway, at one point he emailed Richard Dawkins because Richard Dawkins is kind of the spokesperson for evolution around the world. The most prominent evolutionist out there. And he said, Dr. Dawkins, what's your best evidence that macroevolution's true? Here's what Dawkins said. The reason we know for certain we are all related, including bacteria, is the universality of the genetic code and other biochemical fundamentals. What does he mean? Most living things have the same genetic code. It's expressed in DNA, and that shows that we all have a common ancestor. Could Dawkins be right? Certainly. This could be evidence for a common ancestor. But what also could it be evidence for? Yeah, a common creator, a common designer, right? I mean, that could, it could be, it could, you could interpret the data either way, couldn't you? Could be common ancestor, could be common creator or common designer. But you know what Dawkins has already done? He's philosophically ruled out the only other possible cause other than a natural cause, and that's an intelligent cause. He's ruled out intelligent causes before he looked at the evidence, and so he says it's got to be a common ancestor. Really? He's not right about that. I mean, he could be right that it is a common ancestor, but it's not necessarily true. It could be a common creator.